inspired by Mahashweta Devi's uh, trilogy of, of plays, um, and one of the plays in there, uh, translated from the Bengali, is um, entitled Womb of Fire. So we feel, you know, the fire, the fire element, I guess, is um, we're no longer lamenting, we're roaring. My personal story kind of fleshes it out and it makes it immediate. It gives me that, um, in, the, in the writing of it and in the telling of it, it gives me that emotional kind of like f friction, that spark that makes the, p the piece real, that um, makes the emotions real and, and connected to me, that makes it deeply my story. Born fully formed from a sacrificial fire. Oh! Says King Drupad, what will the people say? Um, Rihanna's mother, great, or mother's grandmother, so her great grandmother, um, the one was from India, South India, and the other was a, a Khoi woman. So these narratives, uh, Rihanna, through research um, and, and also through an amazing historian by the name of Mansal Upam discovered these narratives or came across these narratives and, and kind of almost felt compelled to tell these stories which, was, which were very closely associated with her mother line. In dissecting a Hottentot woman, Zara, the surgeon notices these finger-like prolongations of the nymphae falling down from the pudenda. Two nipples in one breast. The face is purple and swollen. The mont falsch came. Kutikum! Go and ask Dharma. Did he lose me before or after he lost himself? Bring me his answer and I'll go with you. You know, we wanted a, a myth to contain the stories. So uh, looking at the, the myth, mythical and how it intersects with, with the historical and personal narratives, because there's a lot of Rihanna's own personal narrative in there as well. And, and, so, and for us, Draupadi was, was the most appropriate myth Particularly Mahashweta Devi's, again, Mahashweta Devi's Draupadi, where she takes the, the myth from the Mahabharata and translates Draupadi into a tribal woman who is an activist, really. At the end of, of Mahashweta Devi's Draupadi, she, she, she doesn't take the cloth, she strips naked as a, a way of, um, a way of as a pro protest. <laughs> 